Yo, what up guys? Post Christmas recap. Hope you all had an awesome holiday with your friends and family, because I know I did. Uh, I mainly asked for a lot of money and stuff like that so I could buy my own things. So didn't get a lot of material things, but Santa did come through pretty good. He got me three Steiner certified balls for the Hall of Fame PC, which is awesome. I'm going to show them off. First one, I got this one actually off eBay. My parents gave this one to me. has MLB right there in Steiner authentications. And it is of Yogi Berra. So, that's a really big one for me. Uh, this is my second autograph of his. But they didn't have his ball, which I'm very proud to say that I now do own. So, that's definitely a big addition for the PC. Then, that was the first one I opened. Next one I opened was this one. I got to get a case for it. Whoop. With the Triple Crown 66 inscribed. It is Mr. Frank Robinson. There it is. So, that was a pretty easy one that I'm pretty surprised I didn't have, but glad to add that. And the last one was actually a big shock to me, because I knew that I was getting those previous two, because I got one off eBay, and my mom kind of spoiled the other one. But this one I had no idea about. Um, I was really blown away by it, because I wasn't expecting it. But, I'm gonna. it has the 3,142 inscription, and it is Robin Yount. So... I was really excited to get that, completely shocked by that, so definitely a, a big addition. And I just bought, well not yet, but I am in the process of buying a Bob Gibson and um, Tony Gwynn balls. So those should be coming in over the next couple weeks if I get the funds for those, and I gotta buy those. Do have to make uh, a trip to the post office, have a bunch of TTMs I wanna get out. Um, TTM today mail came a little while ago another one for the 1980 hockey thing i think i'm gonna uh, retire it after this though just because i'm not really into it anymore and it's kind of getting annoying now but this one is coming from rob mcclanahan signed it really small over there barely even see it at least he signed this one in silver down there but not sure what i'm gonna do with those yet I might give them to matt or something so um yeah that's that and I made a trade, Michael, uh, with Michael in the Facebook group. Michael, I am very sorry, but I still have your package right here. I have not been able to get it out yet, and that's completely my fault. I'm going to try and go tomorrow if I can, so I really do want to apologize for that. But we, I traded him my James Shields ball for a guy autograph that I've been wanting since last year. He was one of my favorite Mets. Um, I am happy we traded him, but I have just been wanting his autograph since then. Can't believe I didn't have it, but... It is a Major League Baseball sweet spot of R.A. Dickey. <clears throat> so, I'm really happy with that. Yeah, he's one of my favorite. He was one of my favorite Mets. So, um, pretty bummed that he had a bad season, but in the same way, we got Noah in the guard, Travis Darno for him. So, really awesome couple days, guys. Uh, I've been watching your videos. You got some really sick stuff, especially the Grandy Man. I love that Carlos Delgado hat. Mess Fan Forever 101. That Mike Piazza ball just blew me away. Um, I got him IP, but that was really awesome of uh, that. So, guys, that's what I got. Hope you enjoyed watching that. Watch for more videos and more stuff coming in, because I assure you there will be some sick stuff coming soon. Alright, guys. I'll catch you later.